Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Heroes in a Hash Shell, Best Pizza, Box, uh, 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 hey, exclusive from the loyal subjects, yay. Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Heroes in a hash shell, turtle power. Leonardo does machines. Michelangelo is hip, but uh, party dude. Raphael is hip, but crude. Leonardo's the leader. Donatello does machines. I'm messing up on, on the thing, but I um, don't edit my videos. Hey, so Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, Heroes in a Hash Shell, Turtle Power. Leonardo Leo is dedicated, disciplined, and selfless. He's a perfectionist with a strong moral sense. Because of his serious, responsible nature, Leo is like the big brother of the group, Splinter's right-hand turtle, and the leader of the team. Leo, Le Leonardo is the leader. Leonardo's weapon of choice is the twin katana swords. Twin katana blades. These are like... Then we got Michelangelo. He's a party dude. Michelangelo, also known as Mikey, is the impressionist. Patrick Joker and Class Crown. He class clown. Blah, 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 blah. He soaks up all kinds of info from radio, TV, video games, comic books, etc. And more. He's also the most athletic, but the least excited when it comes to training. Michelangelo's weapons of choice are the ninchaku and ninchucks. Oh yeah. And then we got Donatello. Donatello Don or Donnie is the brain of the grapes. He's the brains, but he's got some bronze too. He has an awesome ability to understand how things work. Anything from computers, robotics, combustion engines, rocket propulsions, nuclear bombs, the systems to the light in the fridge, and more. Donnie's a certified self-taught genius. He's super smart, super smart, super smart. Hey, and he was my favorite. Donatello's weapon of choice, ghost of. Then we got Raphael. This hothead is also the most opinionated, impulsive, and restless turtle. Raphael, kind of like me. Raphael, Ralph, loves nothing more than to test himself in battle and trains for sheer enjoyment. He's usually the one to leap into action and it's nearly impossible to get him back down. Raphael's weapon of choice is the twin size, which he's always losing one or the other. And then he goes, oh man, I lost my set. I like, I, I, I like Donatello. He was my favorite because he's smart and I was always thinking about stuff. Michelangelo, he's pretty cool because he's a party dude and stuff. Raphael, I like him, but he's hip but crude. He, he was, he's got like an anger problem, kind of like me and stuff sometimes. And then Leonardo's a leader like me. So I'm like all the turtles. Now let's check them out. Check it out now. So... I guess this is an 800 subscriber special. There's Michelangelo, there's Raphael, there's Leonardo, there's Donatello. Man, as you can see, they both have multiple heads. They all have multiple heads, and they all have red capes. And they all have, like, blood on them from killing Foot Clan ninjas. Now... You might say, hey, I never saw him kill no Foot Clan ninjas on the, in the TV show. Well, I have you know, these are from the comic books by Eastman and Lard. Lard and Eastman. These are like comic book original version of the Turtles. Way back when, you know what I'm saying? When it was all black and stuff. Black and white and red capes. That's right. Let's check him out. Oh. 
I'm probably going to keep them in this box. Just like I did with the um, other turtle thing. But at least I will open them. First up, we have this nice container. Which makes a lot of pink gum noise when you open it. And has stuff that I have to cut out. Oh well, let's check. So, um, the first cool thing that it has in here is this awesome best AXN, like, sticker here. Then, of course, we have Michelangelo right here. Even their shells move. Look at that. Check that out. Shells are moving. Got arms are moving. Hands are moving. And of course you can pop the hands off. But I'm not going to pop the hands off. But yeah. You can pop the hands off. So there's Michelangelo. And of course you can switch the heads. Which again, I'm not going to switch the heads, but I'm going to show you the ninchucks. Also has this, which is goes on the back of him, so that he can hold the ninchucks. That's very good. Um, he also has this, this weapon. And of course, they have double hands. Look at all the hands. I mean, look at that. It comes with two sets of hands. Plus the hands he's already wearing. So, that's cool. Um, next up, we got Raphael. They all come with, of course, a closed mouth and then a smiling open mouth. Also, which I think is pretty cool that the um, turtle shells move. That They did not have to make the turtle shells move, but they did. Um, of course, the feet move 360, the hands move 360, has a lot of, they actually have a lot of articulation, the, even the, uh, his chest kind of moves, kind of moves, and you can kind of take it off if you wanted to. You can kind of take their shells off, which is interesting. But, uh, that's cool. He has these sides, which they're kind of light. Not like the flexible. Not like the originals, which were kind of wonky. You also have this city sewer thing, which is pretty neat. Of course, each turtle has their own little backpack thing. Here's his to hold his size in that go in the back. He also has um, a spear. And a uh, ninja star as secondary weapons, which are pretty neat, pretty awesome. Now we have Leonardo again, head articulation, shell articulation, arm articulation, hand articulation, you know, all the same articulation as the other ones. They're really cool. Of course, as you can see, the hands can pop off. And, of course, 
like I said, you can, you know, replace the hands. Even replace the heads. Cheat it. Well, wow, even the middle pops. Um, so that makes it where you can. I was trying to get the head to pop. But like I said, you can take the uh, shells off, and they still have some um, interesting looks. It still has the sculpt of his chest on the shells. When you take it off of course you can take the head off and switch heads you know <clears throat> that's the classic pose that the original you know original a lot of the original turtles actually had with the mouse grin, the original turtle toys and stuff. So, uh, uh, and besides, somebody would have probably said, hey, I want to see what he looks like with one of the other heads. So, there you go. What he looks like with one of the other heads. Just so somebody won't say that. What does he look like with the other heads? Also have the swords. Which double has two picks. No, I'm just playing. Uh, <laughs> of course, has the uh, little thing to hold the swords in. Then we got Donatello. Same articulation and everything as the other ones. Which is really great. I mean, these turtles have like the best articulation ever. And that's why they're the best. I mean, they were at Walmart for $75, but you can't buy a two pack for less than $50 now. So, four pack for $75 is actually pretty good. The pieces break off, but you can just snap them right back together and I guess the breaking off is so you can help pose them better also the feet you know the pieces breaking apart is kind of a good thing because of uh, customization you know you if you want to like paint them which these turtles are, you know, these turtles are plain black and white. And there are people out there who paint and customize stuff. So, if you wanted to do that with these turtles, you could. And just for the sake of our uh, argument, I'm going to show you what some of the additional hands look like. You got, of course... The regular hands, and then you got, of course, these type of hands, which hold the weapons a little... All the hands can hold the weapons, so that's nice. Um, all, the we all the hands can hold the weapons, but you got, like, fist hands. Then you got, like, chop hands, and then you got, like, another style of hand, which is great. Um, great to have. Then here's his bow staff, which you should be taking your finger staff and hitting the like button, the subscribe button, the bell notification if you don't want to miss anything, and of course, I do do a lot of turtle stuff. I even have a whole entire Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle playlist on my channel, so you should definitely subscribe if you're into turtles. And you should definitely check out that playlist, of course, because I do do, of course, a lot of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles stuff on this channel. Because that is one of the main things I am into. 
Anyway, comment down below your favorite turtle. Comment down below your favorite turtle. Um, and remember, God is good all the time. All the time, God is good. Keep on gaming. Keep on collecting. Like, comment, subscribe, share. Jesus loves you. Jesus is good. Jesus is Lord. Jesus is King. Jesus is ruler of everything. Gain on, collect on. Turtle on. Ninja on. Mike, Mikey on. Raphael on. Leonardo on. Donatello on. Pizza on. And, uh, have a great wonderful day remember God is good all the time all the time God is good not only do you get to see an unboxing but you get to see a boxing on my channel uh, well wow that sucks there's like literally no light I was trying to do something cool but uh I uh, got some additional turtle stuff that I will show off in the next video. But I got it. Hope you enjoyed this video. And stay tuned. And stay subscribed. And stay notified. But you don't want to miss a freaking thing, do you? You don't want to miss a thing. Don't want to miss a thing. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. And uh, have a great, wonderful day. Make sure you watch my other videos because I've done that unboxing right there in my turtle places. The music and mutagen tour turtles, they're pretty cool. I did an unboxing of these, which I only paid, only paid, I only paid $200 for this, by the way, check it out. Sneak peek, if you stayed till the end of the video, you get to see. If not, you didn't get to see those. And you have to go check out my channel. Check out my turtle playlist, which you should be doing anyway. Especially if you like turtles. This is like pretty much my Christmas gift to myself. I got one big ticket item, uh, basically. And of course, there is my turtle shrine, basically. Which, when I do videos of myself, sometimes you can see. Like, so it just keeps getting bigger. It's all over the couch. And every time I keep finding new turtle stuff. I still need to do an unboxing of um, that shredder, and if I, maybe all four of those turtles. I don't know. One day, maybe I'll do the unboxing of all four of those turtles, and maybe I'll do an unboxing of that one one day. And I still really wish I could find the other two turtles with um, but. 
uh, the other two packs. I really wish I could find those. But I'm having a hard time trying to find them. I didn't manage to find those two. Those are the only two I can find. Anyway. It's turtle time. It's actually also time for me to get off of the off and on to the next video.